frustrating delays and expensive fares make them more trouble than they're worth. CBS 2's Tina Patel is live in Corona with the controversy. Tina. Well, Pat, a lot of Inland Empire drivers have long commutes, and so they say when they pay, they expect to get where they need to quicker. Unfortunately, say they say that's not always happening with express lanes. Westbound 91, really heavy out of Corona. It's been just over a year since the 91 freeway express lanes through Orange and Riverside counties opened. And on this Wednesday evening in March, traffic seemed to be moving pretty smoothly. Officials with the Riverside County Transportation Commission say the number of drivers paying the tolls shows that the lanes are working. The 91 doesn't back up, at least in Riverside County, the way it used to. It's because we've added that capacity. But the price for progress? Not all drivers can afford it. A group called the Greater Corona Traffic Alliance shares photos of the changing toll prices online. One-way commutes are often in the $15 to $20 range. I don't use them on a regular basis. It would get very costly. Officials admit tolls are adjusted based on demand. And since usage of the express lanes is about 60% higher than they expected, they've had to raise rates to keep traffic moving. Our main thing is not to try to make a whole bunch of money but it's to try to move as many people as efficiently as we can through the 91 corridor. But drivers say it's not just pricing that's a problem. Some think the express lanes have actually caused more congestion. Their studies only focused in on the freeways and how their project would impact the traffic on the freeways, not the side streets. In the morning, some side streets like Green River and Corona look like parking lots. So what you're seeing is a queue up of 30 to 45 minutes just to get on the freeway. You have people driving on the wrong side of the road, doing all kinds of illegal maneuvers in their cars because they just can't access the freeway. But they're already looking ahead to their next express lane project on the 15 freeway north of the 91 to the 60. San Bernardino County may extend those lanes up through the high desert. They've already got plans to add express lanes on the 10 freeway from Montclair to Redlands. And parts of the 405 through Los Angeles and Orange counties might also get express lanes. So yeah, even though a lot of drivers don't like express lanes, experts say that we are probably going to get them. They say they're easier to fund and they are efficient. So wherever you drive, get used to it. Pat.